Umunem no munam. Oh, kwa wandu mwoke, mwunu mwoke. Eze ndi ibona gana. Eze chiku di judi hene tu. Eze hazume. Umunem di ibono no wanile. Bikon. Um, ndi ro maga kwa la ozo. Ndi ro ebute kula ebu bonzo. Bonyem na mwa weze ndi ibona gana. Na habo. Oni sinde ibu bago. Here in my palace in Ghana. It is never true. This is 100% lies. This is, um, you know, um, I need wrong information from my enemies. Those that are against this throne that I'm sitting on. Those that fought me both in court and other areas. Against this throne that I'm sitting on. Which they did not succeed. Every year they will come up with one propaganda or another against the throne and against me as individual. And the gate they have come again. Last year was allegation against me that I and Ghana government and Nigeria government arrested IPOB. While it's never true. While I am the one that fought for IPOB to have freedom and also so keep supporting IPOB. And finally they lost the battle. God vindicated me and God proved them wrong. This year again, they have started again giving me allegation that I'm harboring a Bubago leader in my house here in Ghana. Umunem no munam is never to be a lie. I don't even know who are the Bubagos. I don't even know who is the leader of a Bubago. I don't even know a single Bubago man. I am from Imo State. I am from Imo State. I am angry. I am bleeding in my heart because... The sons and daughters of Imo State are dying under the hands of Imo Bago, under the hands of uh, unknown men. Then why will I not support? Why will I not support those that are killing sons and daughters of Umu Imo and Dindi Imo entirely? Because Umu Nem no Munam. I have no business. I have no connection. I have nothing to do with Ebu Bago, whether it's Ebu Bago, small boy, big boy, or leader, or for any reason, nowhere. So please, this allegation against me that I'm harboring a Bubago leader in my house is never true. It's a lie. So please, nobody on earth should ever believe this propaganda. Should ever believe my enemies with this um, information that is never true. Every year when we are working hard, planning on how to promote Igbo culture in diaspora, which I am doing for the past 10 years, as I said in Bogana. Next month now, we are working hard to celebrate Igbo New Year Festival and Igbo Day in Ghana and uh, 10 years anniversary of Igbo community here in Ghana, 10 years anniversary of Igbo kinship here in Ghana in diaspora. And now, propaganda has come again. It's always like that every year. Even two years ago, the same enemies put the propaganda against me to Nigeria government, to Ghana government, to Nigerian embassy that I am the sponsor of IPOB in Ghana. For them to put me in problem with all these, all these um, structures. But, yes, I'm an IPOB member. I support IPOB. I can never deny it. I support IPOB because I'm a bad friend. God bless you all. And please, anywhere you are, I want you to know that this allegation against me that I'm harboring a Bubago leader is 100% lie. Don't take it serious. It's 100% lie. My enemies... Whatever you think you are doing against me, you never succeed. Because who God has blessed, God has blessed him. You are not my God. My God is the one that made me a king. You are not my God. And you cannot destroy the blessings of God upon my life. Rather, you that is planning evil, crooked evil, arrange evil against me, the evil will come back to you. You will never succeed. That's my promise. So my brothers and my sisters, anywhere you all over the world, Never believe this truth. It's never true. It's a lie. Every Igbo man in Ghana knows who I am. And they know I'm the I'm number one Igbo man in this country that, that protects, educates, saves, and promotes Igbo people. Not only in Ghana, all over the world. I'm doing the best I can. I've not even finished the good work I'm doing for Igbo. How much more harboring, harboring somebody who's wasting blood of innocent Igbos. Please, it's never true. And that is never true. I can never be part of that. God bless you all. I still remain your brother. His Majesty is a Dr. Ambassador Chukuru Julian Ghana. God bless you all.
Thank you so much for understanding me and for understanding that this is a place of evil and the enemy wants. Thank you. God bless you. Bye-bye.